Hello, Barry here again, and we'll now complete puzzle two. Let's see, and you notice I've marked the ones we've done to make it easier to find the others. Right, where are we going to start now? Well, that looks like a good one. That's, uh, what, six down. Six down, four spaces with an N. Six down, have been in bed. No, that's not it. Hard outer layer of right hand. Hard outer layer of right hand. Okay, over to you. Pause and solve. Okay, looking at that, you would have seen outer, or outer layer maybe. Outer layer is a flag because that's an extreme flag. So it's the outer layer of something and uh, means that either hard or right hand is the key. Uh, hard outer layer is four letters. Six down. Let's just check for letters. There's an N in there. Well, there's an N in hand. So that's going to be the fodder. And we take the hard outer layer of that with an N. Uh, yeah, we take the ND and the RI. We got rind, haven't we? And that's what you've done. You've got the rind there. So, means your key. Now, your key is interesting to get rind. That key is going to be. Not just hard, it's going to be hard outer layer because that's what a rind is. Notice what's happened here that the uh, key includes the trick. Key includes the flag. And that can happen. It doesn't happen that often, but it's happened here. The hard outer layer is the rind. And there it is. And that's uh, extreme. Extreme, okay, there it is, okay, six down, let's mark it in, let's mark it in for six down, is uh, rind, done, okay, next one, we might go across now, eh? we might go across that uh, five across thing, we've got one, five across, pub profit is a good deal, okay, Pub profit is a good deal. Over to you, pause and solve. Okay, you found that no doubt that to fit, to fit that, you have to have a good deal. What's a good deal? A good deal is a bargain. Right, so that's how we get that. So we look at the key and reckon it has to be bargain. And now that's a good deal. But how do you get it? Well, bargain. Let's see. Pub is a bar. Profit is a gain. So there's your there's your bar gain. It's a good deal. And it's simply a charade without a flag. Okay? Happy with that? <laughs> yeah. Okay, next one. How about five down? Five down. We have three givens. B, H, and V. That'll be a big help. Five down. Five down. And here it is here. Have been in bed. And carried on. Pause and solve. Okay. Now, no doubt you've worked out that the answer depends on this. Carried on. Carried on. It's got to be the key because of the answer carried on is behaved isn't it carried on is behaved so we just got to find out how we did it so that is five down have been in bed and carried on well have and bed you can see those two is have has been oh there's the in there's the container flag if you like and have is in bed and you put have in bed you get be, have, ed, which is behaved. There it is. It's all there. It's all there. We proved it. Have been in bed. Yeah, mark 
to the wall. Have in bed B E H A V E D, which is carried on. It's a container. Righto. Happy, happy with that. Okay. Next one. Uh, what about uh, fifteen across with a D? Fifteen across with a D. Okay. Oops. Up to the cross. Employ. Ah. Oh. No, 16 across. Right, no. Made functional, but no longer used on the inside. All right, seven spaces, and with, we have a D to start. Pause and solve. Okay, back again. You know that I picked a flag there uh, on the inside, so it looks like it might be a hidden trick. Or a container trick, one or the other, and uh, well, now uh, did you? Oh, this is a tough one. Looking at that, because sixteen across starts with a D, and uh, it's on the inside, so D is there, D E. D E F U N C T. Now there's defunct. No longer used. And I think that's going to be the answer. Defunct. You've got to work out how to get it now. That's, just, that's the simple part of remaining. How do we get it? Defunct is the answer. So, no longer used is the key. And look where the key is. It's sitting in the middle. Wow. What do you think about that? And there's a fodder before it and a flag up. This is very unusual to have the key in the middle. But there it is. There's your fodder. There's your fodder there. And there. I don't want to do too much. Right. There's your fodder. And there's the answer inside it. And on the inside, that flag refers to this whole fodder right away from it very very unusual and the key is sitting in the middle well defunct defunct is certainly hidden so there it is it's a hidden trick hidden trick and defunct is the answer well how'd you go with that one i bet that pins your ears back a bit right okay next one how about uh eight down Eight down might be a good one. Eight down. We have an N and a G and a T. Eight down. Here we go. Ignore first cat. Taken in by gentle characters. Pause and solve. Okay, how did you go? Looking at that, ignore. Looks like it could be, oh, maybe it's a, maybe it's a mission. But a first is certainly, uh, yeah, that's a that's a first trick, I would say. First trick, and probably a first to cat. First cat, which makes you the C we're looking for. Now, let's take it in by, that looks like a container, a container flag. All right, and uh, ignoring all that, ignore, take it in by. I think that this might be the key up here. No doubt that's what you probably worked out. There's the key. To ignore somebody, to ignore something, and uh, eight down to ignore. Oh, yes, there it is. There, it's good having these little letters, isn't it? To ignore is to neglect. Now, yeah, how do you get it? Eight down, ignore, taken in by gentle characters. Now, gentle characters, characters, now characters. Characters could be an anagram flag. Characters, rearrange the characters. So gentle could be the fodder, I would say. And characters is going to be an anagram flag. Well, how about that? Although it doesn't show it there. Take it in by. So I reckon that's a container. Take it in by. And uh, characters, 
uh, is an anagram flag, even though it's not marked. And uh, ignore first cut. It's a first, first a container, and uh, anagram. Well, that's a lot, isn't it? First a container and anagram. Hasn't got the anagram there, but you've got to, you just can't. That doesn't give you neglect unless you rearrange it. Definitely an anagram there as well. So there it is. Eight down is neglect, and that's how you get it. Okay, next one. Well, that's an easy one across there. Look at that. That's uh, 12 across. 12 across. Here we have it. No money for cashmere. Nothing more. No money for cashmere. Nothing more. Okay, pause and sold. Okay, done. This one wasn't too hard because no money and nothing more. No money is no cash. If you take out cash, you get Mia, which is nothing more. There's the whole answer there. All done. All done. Did you get all that? If you take the cash out of cash, Mia, because that's no money, no cash, you're left with Mia. Okay, there's your Mia, and that's nothing more. Mia, nothing more, Mia. Mia is the answer to that. Okay, 12 across, have you put Mia in yet? You better do it. 12 across, Mia, let's put that in there. Okay, Mia is the answer. Right, okay. Well, that one doesn't look too bad. What's that? That's 14 down. 14 down, it's got an F. Five letters and an F. Attach some of RAF fixtures. See the F there? See, these things are a big help. See the F. Some of. Oh, I better, I better shut up. Pause and sold. Right, now that you've seen it all, some of, some of is a, uh, an emission flag, we're going to emit something from somewhere, and it uh, looks like the F, we're going to use the F, so it's half, emit some of that, and if you emit some of, some of uh, that, then you get uh, an answer for attach, attach, and of course you know the answer, no doubt you've got it, 14 across, uh, 14, 14 down, is it? 14 down, rather. And uh, that is that is a fix. If you attach, you are a fix. And you can see it there. Uh, A, F, F. There it is there. I, X. There's your fix. Okay. So it's simply an emission flag. If you omit some letters, and you're left with your answer. Okay, next one. What about this one across here? 19 across. 19 across has an I there. 19 across. Actors Lloyd and Bo are crossing rivers. Actors Lloyd and Bo are crossing rivers, seven spaces. Over to you, pause and solve. Now don't forget to do this pausing and solving because it's nowhere near as valuable listening to what I say, even though I think it's pretty important, but, but it's nowhere near that important as you trying it yourself and then coming back and seeing it. That's important. Look, it doesn't matter if it takes you five, ten minutes to do it. That's what you do. You must try yourself. Okay, over to you, pause and solve. Okay, you got it? Who are the actors Lloyd and Bo? Well, that's Lloyd Bridges and Bo Bridges, and that's Crossing Rivers, so it all seems to add up to me. Right? So Crossing Rivers looks like the key. No doubt you've worked that out. And Crossing Rivers are bridges, so it's 19 down is bridges. And there it is there. B-R-I-D-G-E-S fits in with the spaces and the givens. Bridges and uh, Lloyd and Bo. Uh, Lloyd Bridges and Bo Bridges. So there it is. Lloyd and Bo. 
and uh, it's probably a double key because Lloyd and Bo give the same answer. You'd say Lloyd and Bo bridges, you'd say crossing rivers, also bridges. There it is, a double key. Okay, next one. Well, this looks fairly simple now. Across here, we have 19 across, 19 across. More lively British leader takes risks with, key, with Queen. Okay, over you go, pause and solve. Okay, back again, looking at that. Leader, looks like that's a first trick. First letter and something. Uh, with looks like an, a charade flag. So I think the action's down that end. So more lively could be the key. No doubt you've worked that out. More lively. Now the British leader is is B. So that's your fodder British. First letter in that is B. Okay. And no doubt we've added that to uh, risk. It takes risk. And queen as well. I would say you have to add them both. Take risks with queen. And uh, it's a big charade. So it's B, risk. And of course that's the R. B, risk, E, R. Brisker. Brisker, that's where it came from. 19 across is brisker. Brisker. Does that agree with what we thought was the key? It does, doesn't it? More lively is brisker. Okay, so the tricks we use are, of course, the first and the charade. Okay, next one. Next one. This one down here looks interesting. Uh, it's 20 down, 20 down. So we have try Lee's arrangement and completely change fashion. Pause and solve. No doubt, you're back again. And uh, you know that saw arrangement is probably going to be an anagram flag. Uh, completely change fashion. Okay, change could be too, of course, but there's an anagram there. All right, so I'd say that the arrangement, uh, try leaves couldn't be a key. That's has to be a, a fodder. So, and there's, we need seven letters, and there's seven there, look. Four and three, seven. So you anagram try leaves, and the key is completely change fashion. And if you completely change fashion, what do you do? You, and look at, look at, your, look at your spaces over here. Uh, 20 down, 20 down, starting with an R. If you re, re something, and of course it's restyle, isn't it? Completely change fashion is restyle, and you can see it here. R E S T Y L E. There it is, all done. It's an anagram flag. Simple as that. Anagram flag. Not simple, really. But you've got to try and, and uh, you just persevere, you'll be right. Okay, next one. We might do this one, looks across. Uh, that's uh, 23 across. 23 across. 23 across. Arches, oddly enough, are champions. Arches, oddly enough, are champions. All right, pause and solve. Okay, back again. You've seen oddly enough is a flag for alternates. So we have an alternate trick on our hands and you had to decide where the key was by using your knowledge of the spaces over here. Right, and no doubt you've come up with an alternate. You can see the A, you can see the uh, A and the S there, look. So yes, Champions, Champions is going to be your key, no doubt, and this is going to be your fodder. Take the alternate letters and that, and you get A, A, this is making red, A, 
C, E, yes, they're aces, aren't they? Champions are aces, and that all makes sense. Okay, and that is an alternate trick. Okay, so 23 across is simply aces. You can see there's A, C, E, S there. Okay. Where's the black pointing? There. Aces. Okie dokie. Almost there, aren't we? Right. I think this one across here looks like we should do it next. 28 across. Span, broken. Leg with a sequin. Starts with an S and ends with an E. Span, broken leg with a sequin. All right. Pause and solve. Okay, right, now you see uh, broken, looks like an anagram flag, so we have to anagram something, and this seven letters says you need a seven letter fodder, well there's, there's a span and a leg there, in between the broken, so, or in the, it's broken in between them, so I'm assuming those two will be the fodder, okay. And sequin is the key, therefore, and no doubt you realise that sequin has another synonym, which is by anagramming that you'll see it, and you'll see it, it is a spangle. Okay, spangle, done. And these things take time, you've just got to sit down and think about them. Okay, nearly there, watch this one down here, we'll go for that. 25 down, 25 down, bill available, bill available to hold molten rock, 25 down, four spaces, and don't forget what's given there, all right, an A at the end, molten rock, well, molten rock with an A, we can just write that down, can't we, molten rock with an A is going to be only one thing, lava. All right, and how do we get it? Well, you can see molten rock, make that the key, of course. And uh, bill available to hold. Hold looks like a, a, a hidden or a container trick. And bill available. So bill available is nothing to do, doesn't make sense. It's just a fodder. It hasn't got to make sense, it's just a fodder. Because inside that is lava. Look, there it is there. Okay. That's your lava there. Right. Okay. So that is a hidden trick. Okay. I think we're happy with that. Hidden trick. Right. What's left? Not much. We have a long one coming down. Two long ones. All right, let's go across here because there's a lot of letters we've got now. Okay, 26 across. 26 across. Over to you. No, let's read the clue first. Okay. 26 across. What's the point of equilibrium when centre of gravy covers it? Okay. Pause and solve. Right. Got it all sold, sorted out. Uh, that too interests me. I can always get a suggestion for if there's two spaces, it could be an an, an or, or of. There's not much else it can be. So uh, we keep that in mind. That's just this, these two here. So looking at that, I can see something that looks very interesting with a point of equilibrium. Yes, well, I think we've got it. You can see that in the point of equilibrium. What's the point of equilibrium? It's the center of gravity, isn't it? And there you have the word center. The gravy covers it. Ah, yes. So there we have it all added up together. Center of gravy. If you have the center of, that gives you the center of first. And there's your center of. This is all the charade. Center of. And gravy covers it. If gravy covers it, you're going to have gravity, aren't you? G-R-A-V, 
IT, why? So there it is. It's a charade and a container and its center of gravity. Ah, it wasn't too bad. Well, it wasn't too good, but it wasn't too bad. And the last one here is this one, which is seven down. Seven down, we have lots of letters now. And so it shouldn't be too hard. Seven down, far from being dead and buried. Footballer is active and in good health. Paws and soul. Right, back again. Doesn't seem to be a flag. No flag there. So, um, seven down. It's a long one. Well, three spaces could be an and. It could be an and or it could be a the. And if you think about it, if you thought about it, as you have no doubt, far from being dead and buried would be your key because it means, what does it mean? If you're far from being dead and buried, you are alive and kicking. And that's what it is, alive and kicking. Why is that so? Well, footballer is active. What's a footballer do? He kicks. All right, so he's kicking. He's kicking. All right. And uh, in good health, he's alive. In good health, yes, that's an alive part. And the and is there too. So it's back to front, of course. You've got the kicking and alive, or if you like, it's the alive and kicking. And that's where you get the alive and kicking from. What do you think about that one? Well, a bit of fun. Okay, that's it. I hope you enjoyed it. But please make sure that you pause the, the video, look at it while you're working at it. It's all there on the screen for you. Just work on it while it's there and then come up with the answer. And then if you can't get it, or whether you can or you can't, then check my answer. But please pause and solve. It's the only way you're really going to learn. Okay, and thank you for watching.